this in the beginning of the khutbah. MashaAllah, tabarakAllah, they have a heart with a good intention. And they want to correct themselves. And they want to cover. And you see them covering properly in every way. And then they are exposed to the YouTube hijab tutorials. And Allahul Musta'an, some shaytana, a devil in the sight or in the clothing of a human being comes and says that this is how you should wear your hijab. And then they take this sister who wants to wear the hijab and they ruin her. And they teach her how to beautify her hijab so that she looks more beautiful in her hijab than she does out of her hijab. And in Facebook and Twitter and all of the rest, that the people are there and they are not saying to our sisters, take off your hijab. They are telling them to take it off in a different way, to beautify it, to put on the makeup, to wear it in a style that makes you look good. I say to our sisters in Islam, if your hijab looks good, it is not the Islamic hijab. Wallahi, if your hijab looks good, you have contradicted the very asal, the very fundamental, the very purpose of the hijab. The purpose of the hijab is to divert the sight. The purpose of the hijab is to conceal. The purpose of the hijab is to protect. The purpose of the hijab is to set a standard and to send a message that this sister is a practicing Muslim woman and she's not the kind of cheap individual with low self-worth that sells themselves for a low price. That is what the hijab is for. And there are sisters telling our sisters in Islam and most of them are from the Sufiya or from the people from Ahlul Bid'ah and they are coming and telling our sisters in Islam to remove their hijab in a different way. Whether it is the way that they wear it or the color or the design or the way to look at it and none of them have any knowledge of Islam or any knowledge of fiqh and yet they come and in a way that attracts people who want to practice Islam and this is from the shubahat that we must be careful of.